Donald Trump's critique of Kamala Harris revolves around her inconsistent policy stances and shifting views on his MAGA philosophy. He argues that despite her years in high office, she hasn't driven meaningful change, especially on major issues like immigration and the economy. Trump's frustration taps into broader public concerns about inefficient leadership and missed opportunities to address pressing national challenges. His focus on immigration, portraying it as a critical crisis, reflects public anxiety over border security and the perceived economic and national security risks posed by illegal immigration. His assertion that many immigrants are criminals, coupled with his framing of illegal immigration as a direct threat to the nation's stability, appeals to conservative viewpoints prioritizing law, order, and robust border control to safeguard American interests philosophies like they have and policies like they have. I don't say her because she has no policy. Everything that she believed three years ago and four years ago is out the window. She's going to my philosophy now. In fact, I was going to send her a MAGA hat. She's gone to my philosophy. But if she ever got elected, she'd change it. And it will be the end of our country. She's a Marxist. Everybody knows she's a Marxist. Her father's a Marxist professor in economics, and he taught her well. But when you look at what she's done to our country, and when you look at these millions and millions of people that are pouring into our country monthly, where it's, I believe, 21 million people, not the 15 that people say, and I think it's a lot higher than the 21, that's bigger than New York State pouring in. And just look at what they're doing to our country. They're criminals. Many of these people coming in are criminals. And that's bad for our economy, too. You know, you mentioned before, we'll talk about immigration later. Well, bad immigration is the worst thing that can happen to our economy. When Trump brands Harris as a Marxist, it plays into fears of ideological inconsistency or opportunism, fueling skepticism about her political positions. Such rhetoric aligns with public demands for leaders who hold firm, unwavering values that prioritize the nation's needs. At the heart of this critique is the public's concern with authentic leadership, trust, and the consequences of policy failures. Trump's message underscores the need for strong, consistent leadership that mirrors the values of the populace. His repeated accusations that Harris lacks clear policy direction and has failed to take decisive action resonate with fears of weak leadership that prioritizes political survival over genuine accountability. In Trump's narrative, Harris's perceived indecisiveness and the administration's inability to resolve key issues particularly immigration, suggest long-term risks to the nation's stability and identity.